one truth. It's time for the Jedi to end. I think I put a lot more pressure on myself this time, because the first time around I was just like, woo, Having filming, fun. yeah. And then this time was, not that it wasn't like that, but I felt I understood much more Star Wars' impact and also Ray's impact in the story, so I felt more pressure on myself to try and do whatever it was that I did the first time around that people responded to, because I didn't know what I'd done. So I think as a professional, I now have a much greater understanding of how hard people work to make the things that people love. Um, and also to be on a set where everyone is really, really lovely. I feel really lucky that my first two film experiences were Star Wars is with just the most wonderful people. And it is overwhelming. It can be overwhelming when people are like, Wah! but ultimately it's a good thing. Like it's a lovely film. It's a lovely universe. It brings people together. And people are kind to each other when they're talking about Star Wars. Like no opinion is stupid. Like every opinion is valid. Um, and so it's wonderful to be part of that. I think Ray asks uh, questions the audience is asking. Ray wants to know where she comes from. Ray wants to know where she's going. Powerful darkness. So good to have you back. So I think there's a sense when you're making a film, when a fan is making a film for fans, ultimately things are going to be as a lot of fans want. But I think with um, Ryan, with this film at least, it goes, because of the unexpected way it goes, everyone is going to be like, awesome, but it will be, it will be conversational. Like it will make people ask um, more questions and hopefully surprise people. It's so much bigger. One truth.